Hello guys, today I'll be reacting to the new Pokemon Presents that is happening. Right now I'm just waiting for it to actually start, because sometimes it just doesn't start, sometimes it does, sometimes you gotta wait a bit. You know how it would be. Uh, okay, we got the timer right here, it's gonna start in a minute. Okay. Because I always think it starts, like, before, you know, like, exactly the time it says, but sometimes, you know, you gotta wait a few minutes for it to actually do the thing. Ugh, kinda disappointing, but whatever. We have to wait a bit. Oh no, what am I possibly gonna do? What am I gonna do? What am I gonna do? What am I gonna do? Of course. Yeah, let's go, baby. I'm kind of, you know, not watching an RP that's happening right now. But, you know, whatever. Who cares? We have Pokemon. 10, 9, and 7, slash, 5, 4, 3, 2, 1. Yeah, let's, let's do it. We got Pikachu. We got Pikachu! I gotta move it so I can actually, you know, watch. In today's Pokemon Presents, we will be sharing information on several of our games. Da 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 da. Let's go, let's get the news. <laughs> Before that, I'm happy to share some mobile news. Oh, they're talking about the championship site. Yeah, I don't really care. I'm, I never watched those. <sighs> <sighs> oh my god. Sorry if I'm like lucky like a jackass, but I just really don't care about the Pokemon Champion. three years, our global community will come together August 18th to 21st in London for not only intense Pokemon battles, but also to be together, celebrating old friendships and creating new ones, all in the spirit of friendly competition. We are expecting thousands of players from around the world. Are they talking about the card games or the video games? Oh, they're talking about all of it. Okay. <sighs> Losing my mind. Losing myself. Da, 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 da. I just want game info. Please join me in welcoming Pokemon Go. Where nearly 100 players will compete oh damn, Pokemon Go is getting competitive, what the fuck? Oh, okay. I, I know, United is competitive, but how is Pokemon competitive? Pokemon Go competitive, I mean. We also have a few surprises in store for fans attending. Including our largest ever world It's too early for me. I wanted to do, like, make this video as soon as I can as, like, a live reaction, so, yeah. Go wait for this. The World Championship. Oh my god. Take a look. Is it like an actual trophy with Pikachu? It is. <laughs> That's Thank clever. You. We look forward to seeing you in London, and now I would like to hand it back to Mr. Utsunomi. Let's see some Pokemon news, boy. Thank you very much, Mr. Brown. With the Pokemon World Championships returning after three years, Please look forward to exciting battles to keep you on the edge of your seats. Ah oh. oh, dang, it's been three years. Share some news about a few of our games. Okay, let's see what's first. Is this Pokemon? Uh, yeah, Pokemon Go. Well, we have like, you know, home places where you can spin the Pokestop for your own house yet. Oh, never mind. They're talking about Ultra Beasts. Okay, but I don't really care about Ultra Beasts in the game. Why am I so tired? 
I should be this tired. This is Pokemon news. This is my thing. This is the thing I've been waiting for. By completing special research, will you be able to help re contend with the Ultra Beasts? And what has become of Professor Willow, who was sucked into Ultra Space through an Ultra Wormhole? Stay tuned for the story's conclusion. <laughs> Additionally, Daily oh. Adventure Incense has been added to the game. It's a special incense that can be used once a day and lasts for 15 minutes. If Only 15 minutes? Fuck you! <laughs> Give us an all day incense. Daily adventure incense for a 15 minute adventure every day. Over the past six years, we've seen Pokemon from Yeah, we've seen Pokemon from everywhere in this game. Now over 700 Pokemon you can register to the Pokedex. Oh, damn, 700. But you know, if you have all the games, it doesn't really matter because Pokemon Go is Pokemon Go and not Pokemon Home. Okay, we got Unite news. I, I don't really care for Unite. Is that fucking red cheekies? <sighs> Wait, did they say campaigns? A new type of quick battle, Pika Party, will begin today, August 3rd. I assume Pika Party is just Pikachu. Yeah, it's just Pikachu. Pikachu! Both wild and players are Pikachu. We hope you join in the festivities. Yeah. We got Pikachu, boys. And we got this Pokemon coming in. Buzzwool is an all rounder that can grapple opposing Pokemon and launch them into the air. Run him up in battle with Buzzwool's ability, Beast Boost, which temporarily increases Buzzwool's movement speed and basic attack speed uh, each time it knocks out an I don't know anything about Pokemon Unite or really care that much. Like, I really don't care about Unite. For September as well, so please stay tuned. <laughs> we'll be gifting Unite licenses and Hollowware for Pikachu. Let's go. There's a lot of Pokemon coming. You got a big thing coming, honey. <laughs> What's here? Is this is this Scarlet Violet news? Are we gonna get climbing? Will climbing be a feature in Scarlet and Violet? We got red on a mountain. Is this a remake? Oh my gosh, if this is a remake, that'd be great. No, no, it is Pokemon Masters. And we got N. We got Professor Sycamore. I never played Masters, so I'm not really interested. Yeah, we, we, we have characters. There's new content apparently coming. Is this going to be an interesting thing? Oh. I heard a hungry noise. We got Mewtwo in Cafe. Okay. Cool. I, I love Pokemon Cafe. I think it's a cute mobile game. I never played it, but I think it's just adorable. Yes, let, let's go. This is going to be on E621. <laughs> this is going to be... Yeah, unfortunately, this is going to, you know, follow the rules of the internet. Get porn of it. <laughs> but whatever. We... More cafe news. That's always good. Yeah. If you want to aim for the high score, try raising your Pokemon stat level. Go to the Pokemon menu to start raising your stat level. Okay. Pokemon, Pokemon Cafe. Look at that dapper Latios. That is a good looking Latios. There we go. We morph. 
more. More. <laughs> this is pretty impressive. Yeah, we we got them. There's Victini. This is pretty interesting. Didn't really expect this to happen, but it did anyways. <laughs> oh, we were getting more Scarlet and Violet stuff, it appears. Unless this is just for a spinoff. <laughs> Let's go! Let's go! This does not reflect that whole gameplay. Ah, uh, no. We get all these good looking areas, you know? Decent looking areas. Too bad this isn't like actual gameplay. Well, not for reflective of actual gameplay, but this looks good. This looks decent. <laughs> Oh, look at that. We meet them on a beach? Okay. I guess they were rideable all along. OMG, whoever said they're rideable called it. <laughs> yeah, there, there they go. Oh, climbing! Let's go, baby! Climbing and flying! <laughs> yeah! Let's fucking go! Okay, I guess one is more of a bike than the other. Whatever. Oh man, these places look decent. They look good. I hope they aren't just, you know, annoying. Oh yeah, we get these interesting Pokemon groups. Was that leg that I just saw? I don't know. Where would we go? We can go anywhere, I guess. <laughs> I will meet, uh, these losers. I will achieve doing your mom. <laughs> oh, new Pokemon. Okay. We got this hot rod thing. Damn. They're showing off a lot here. Well, at least more than the other trailer. Wait, holy shit. Actual multiplayer. Actual multiplayer? Is this a thing? Damn. Oh, these battles looking good, though. They're looking kind of fresh. Oh, new mechanic. We got crystal mechanic right here. Crystallized Pokemon. Damn. I mean, we could have expected this, but... Yeah. Crystal Pokemon. Is that fucking giant, Max? Are they bringing back old stuff? New forms, or whatever, for the legendaries. Was that fucking giant, Max, though? I'm gonna have to go back on that, because... Damn! Jesus! If they bring back Giantamax, I hope they're bringing back fucking Megas. <laughs> the newest titles in the Pokemon series are the Pokemon Star and Pokemon Violet games. These titles will be open world RPGs, a first for the Pokemon series. I hope we can just do anything. Together to form the Paldea region, where your Paldea new region. Okay, okay. We can ride these Pokemon. Pokemon. And Mirada. You'll rely on one of them as a partner in your adventure. Climb on. Do we get these early also? What the hell? That's new. Move across water and glide through the sky. Damn. <laughs> your partner can change forms as needed while you explore every nook and Hopefully we don't have to unlock them. these forms. If we do that'd be Kind of disappointed if we can't unlock them without beating a gym. At a certain academy as a <laughs> oh, we're a student in this game. Uh, okay, that's and new. Special independent study project awaits you. The treasure hunt. Oh. You'll embark on a journey to find treasure of your own. That is 
That is amazing. All these grand stories are waiting for you. One story will revolve around the familiar gym battle. You'll go to eight Oh, we got gyms. Aim for the champion rank. Hopefully they don't scale gyms. I mean, hopefully they do scale gyms. <laughs> Almost got mixed up there. Oh, we got that new Pokemon. The other two stories you'll experience hold many surprises and discoveries as well. Yeah, we we saw the pimped out ride. And we have towers? What? Okay. <laughs> okay, this is... This isn't what I was expecting. This is a surprise. Mr. Jacques is your homeroom teacher. Mr. Jacques? What is he, French? We, we got this person I don't care about. And then we got this mid. Also, the only good character here. They're okay. Like, some of the designs are either okay or mid. <laughs> oh, they're gonna show off more Pokemon. Oh, we got Rage of Pokemon. I didn't notice that, but now that I'm looking at it, I should have. Okay. Are delightfully squishy Pokemon that are smooth to the touch. Oh, cute. Satitan, which has a Satitan baby! I want one on my fucking team! Oh, of course we got the starters. I hope they don't reveal the evolutions. We got old Pokemon, okay. As long as they bring back the Pokemon they missed in the other games. I'm pretty happy. Oh, kind of like books in the fucking decks, I guess. Using the union circle, you can enjoy co -op play with oh my god! No way. No fucking way. Are you serious? Oh my god. <laughs> Actual co-op. We're not like talking about just trades and battles. We got people that can enter your game. They're showing off the new forms. The okay. Makes Pokemon shine like gems. <laughs> yeah, I should have probably expected this from the last trailer. Because, you know, the last trailer had those crystal things. Oh. They actually kind of have All new forms. Are able to or new designs for their forms. I'm kind of surprised they did it with, like, the base evolutions. Some Pokemon will change type when they oh, some change type. Okay, I guess Pikachu, yeah, guess what fly. They become seems to depend on that Pokemon's Terra type. Huh. That is interesting. For example, I am surprised. typically remain normal type after terastalizing. But there could be Eevee that become grass or water type after oh. terastalizing. That's pretty interesting. Okay. Pokemon with rare Terra types. New things to breed, I guess. Of course, they bring back raid battles. <laughs> so they're not Mega Evolutions. They're Terra Evolutions. Why didn't they bring Megas back, though? Yeah. Whatever. This is kind of like a more updated raid battle. Yeah. After you successfully defeat a Terra Pokemon, you can capture it. Yeah, like normal raid battles. Okay. Will they bring back Dynamax evolutions or the other ones? I really hope so, but what they showed here is way better than the first trailer. I'm actually excited. While evolving the adventure you can have in Pokemon Scarlet and Pokemon Violet. This is pretty interesting, okay. We hope you look forward to the day you set out on your adventure. 
the day you set out on your adventure. So yeah, it's not like regular Pokemon multiplayer. You actually get people visually on your screen. Early purchase, you receive Pikachu. Okay. Guess I'm getting Pikachu. Whatever. <laughs> oh. Okay. Are you sure that's all? Are you sure that's everything? I, I don't think that's everything. I don't trust these credits. I'm not going to trust these credits. Trust no ho. But damn. I'm actually more excited. No, I, I do not want the Doof's Big Sand. Okay, I guess that was everything. <laughs> I am honestly excited. To be honest, I thought it was like Mega. That they. I mean, I thought they showed up. Dynamax, but I guess that might not be in the game. That's kind of unfortunate. But you know what? I'm happy with what they showed. I'm actually excited for this game. Because I was kind of skeptical after that uh, first trailer. That first trailer was just eh. But once they showed off, like, you can ride your Pokemon. Uh, let me get to it. You can ride the legendaries. I kind of made it exciting. Trying to find the point where you ride them. Yeah, this is kind of exciting. And also the fact that you can, you know, fly with them as well. Yeah. This is what kind of made me more excited about this game. Like, you can fly without using the menu, you know. How you usually do, you press fly and then you go to a certain place... No, this is like Legends Arceus with that, uh, I'm trying to remember what Pokemon it was. I don't have Legends Arceus, so I wouldn't remember. But yeah, it's kind of like Legends Arceus where you can go anywhere while you're flying. Pretty much. Which makes me excited because I thought they would go the Sword and Shield route where, you know, nothing is in the sky. It, you just appear somewhere when you use fly. But nah, they're using the Legends Arcus thing where they, you know, let you fly anywhere in the world, in-game, instead of, you know, clicking location, and then being boring as hell. Now they took the Legends Arceus route and made it actually fun traveling the world. They actually made it a fun time. And also you can go everywhere, blah blah blah. We know this because open world game. And also they show off more of the areas, which is pretty nice. You know, you get to know what you're going through in the game. But not enough to spoil the game entirely, which is nice. You know, for list 5 would probably want you to, you know, spoil everything about the game. But, you know, whatever. And then they show off some characters... I really like some of their designs, like Penny and the Ice Gym Leader. Those are the nicest looking ones. And then they show off, they have regional forms, which is pretty nice. So yeah, to say I'm excited for this game is kind of an understatement, because, you know, the last latest game I played was Pokemon Brilliant Diamond Shine Pearl. That was a disappointment. And also playing Sorted Shield. That was also a disappointment. I'm excited for this game. I'm honestly God happy for this game to release. I'm very excited. They're taking kind of like, oh yeah, main battle gimmicks. You have to and then capture them. That's whatever. That's like a minor complaint right now. But here, they're like, you get these new forms. Hopefully they bring back old forms. You get these regional Pokemon. And also you get the exploration kind of gear. You know, flying, riding, whatever. All that from Legends Arceus. 
you know, you can explore everywhere, like Legends Arc is, so, yeah. It pretty much brings the fun of Legends Arc is to this game, pretty much. Which, I like Legends Arceus Exploration. I don't even have to play the game to tell you it's better than Sorted Shield's Exploration. But yeah, I am very excited for this game, and uh, that's it.